Ok. Oh putain. On est obligé, mec, on est obligé. Ah 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 Oh Oh euh, Je pense pas que j'aurai assez pour les autres, j'ai tout dépensé. Voilà. Silence. Merde, fallait que je me sorte de la caméra. Unfortunately, I lack the ability to unlock doors. You're like a broken record, you know that. I'll deal with it. Oula. Pourquoi il m'en veut que j'aille là-bas Ok j'y vais Ah voilà <coughs> Bon, bah on va utiliser le terminal qui est là. Ok, what do we have here? Are you planning to disable the Hawk? It isn't responsible for opening the VDNH's doors, you know. Uh, well, I gotta do something, voilà. ok? I'll start with the Hawk. Hmm. Bon, en tout cas, c'est fait. Ferme là.
It's the Hawk's service button. What does it do? It will cause the Hawk <laughs> to land, so it can be serviced by a technician. How long will it stay there for? If it fails to make contact with a technician, not long. Then we need to move. What are you planning? I'm gonna take a ride on the Hawk and get a better view of the place. Maybe I'll see something. Faut que j'aille à l'eau. Ah ouais. Non mais je sais. What should I do? Hang on to this handle or something? Hold on tight. Hawks are not designed to be ridden. <coughs> What are these cables for? They weren't here before. The cables stabilize the hawk during bad weather. Ah, là. Maybe I can slide down a cable. Ne, je sens la reine de combat. From a bird's eye view, you can see that the grass in the park was planted in the shape of the peaceful atom. Non, mais... Bird's eye view. Oh putain, j'en étais sûr. Dans sa ta gueule, tu vois. Et elles sont au G7. Euh... What the fuck? Bah, la musique est très coulante. Aïe! Ça loupe pas. Euh, comment je fais là pour l'arrêter Wow euh, Là je suis mal, je suis très très mal. Sérieux, fallait que j'attende qu'il finisse sa ronde. You have far more experience with combat robots than I do. I, I do? I mean... Oh, putain. Shit, I do, but... I can't remember a damn thing. They seem okay, different niveau, uh... somehow. Putain, fallait que j'attende ça. Fallait que j'attende ça rentre n'importe quoi. Really tell on the something really important. <coughs> I wish there weren't bodies all over the damn place. The celebration will be held on Monday in honor of national polymerization and the launch of Collective 2.0. All the highest ranking members of the Communist Party will be here. I can fix all this by then. I certainly hope your optimism turns out to be justified. It will. You'll see. I won't let Dr. Section off down again. <coughs> More locked doors. Who the hell keeps locking everything? Whoever he is, I bet he's got a goddamn combination lock on the John at home. These doors will be opened via a symbolic gesture during the ceremony. Symbolic how? The system of mirrors will focus beams of light on the model of our solar system hanging above the entrance. I'll see what I can do. Là. Great. The mirror on the right is all set. Uh, the mirror on the left isn't working. Something is jamming the mechanism and preventing the mirror from ascending. Got it. Looks like it's back to the basement for me. Euh, comment je rentre Oh. No entry. 
And a skull and crossbones. That's encouraging. Where am I? The magnetic shock absorption system is located on this basement level. All the rooms here are full of mobile electromagnetic clusters. I can use an EMP on them. Fading data. It's not gonna kill me, is it? Let's <clears throat> hope not, Comrade Major. What? So I... You get crushed by a falling wall of magnets? Theoretically speaking, that shouldn't happen, but this is merely a hypothesis. I've never been here before. Seriously? That's weird. Well, whatever. Whoa. Comrade Major, have you made it to the VDNH? Kinda. What's that supposed to mean? It means I'm kinda almost there. I'm in the magnetic shock absorption chamber, looking for a way to unlock the entrance doors. Can you open them for me? No, I can't. I don't have the skills. This is your responsibility. Then get off my grill. But. Okay. <clears throat> Damn it. Fading data. Je sais que t'es pas mort, hein. Goddamn mustaches again. What the? Ah, la saleté. C'est bon. Je comprends jamais ce truc hein. Venez par là. Another door without a lock. Ugh. Where's the relay, Charles? I don't see anything on the walls. This fucking <coughs> anyway. The magnetic shock absorption system was developed by scientists from Kiev Polytechnic University. It's a very complex and comprehensive device that alters its configuration according to the situation. So it's plan B in case of a natural disaster. Among other things. But it is first and foremost a trial run of the magnetic shock absorption system. Here, under Earth conditions, the system will be perfected so that it can be deployed in space. Cool. Science is power. There's no denying it. But we still need Aye, to find a way yeah. past all these goddamn magnets. See. Voilà. Mais non. Je pense ça. Ok. 
Ouais, J'ai cru que ça allait m'écraser ce truc. Je sais comment moi pour passer. Sérieux. Charles, what the hell does Molotov have against Dr. Sechenov? Why do you have to cook this commission up two days before the launch of Collective? Everything's ready. Exactly because everything is ready. What do you mean? Are you trying to say that Molotov and his commission want to steal the fruits of Sechenov's labor two days before the launch? Indeed. The malfunction Petrov caused is an excellent pretext for showing that Dr. Sechenov is incapable of overseeing Facility 3826, and by extension, the polymerization of the Soviet Union. What's the boss got to do with it? This is all Petrov's fault. He's the one who made the robots <clears throat> turn the facility into a heap of corpses. I'm afraid Comrade Molotov doesn't care how many victims there are, but neither does Comrade Sechenov. What? What the fuck are you talking about, Glove? The boss is doing everything he can to fix this. To be precise, Comrade Major, it's you doing everything you can to fix this, not Dr. Sechenov. But he's the one who sent me here. But why did he do that? Think about it logically. Comrade Sechenov and Molotov both have something to gain from preventing information about this terrible malfunction becoming known to the rest of the world. Because no one would believe that a handful of traitors are responsible for the whole thing. Everybody would think that Soviet robots are dangerous. Quite right. But what conclusion should we draw from this? Only that, hypothetically, comrades Sechinov and Molotov should both have a vested interest in ending this nightmare as quickly as possible. Isn't that right? Yeah. So what? We're seeing a common everyday power struggle. Instead of going to the government and having troops sent to facility 3826 to destroy the hostile robots, arrest Petrov, or end this in some other way, Dr. Sechenov is doing everything he can to conceal the tragedy from everyone, including the government. Hmm. Ah, je vois. They can't send in the army. There are too many people. Somebody could leak intel to the enemy and then it's all over. But what? only reliable men could be sent to the facility, such as the Argentum unit loyal to Sechenov. They could team up with combat robots and restore order in the blink of an eye. But I don't need to tell you about that, do I? But that's, I mean, ugh, crispy critters. I don't get it. Why does it have to be so complicated? Because Dr. Sechenov can't deploy troops or combat robots without the authorization of the Politburo. On the contrary, he's doing everything he can to make sure the government doesn't know what happened. Why do you think that is? Because his enemies would take Collective away from him? Now, when everything's built and ready to go, and any asshole with a badge could run it. Quite right. It's all done. Just fix the malfunction and press a button. Geniuses, creators, and engineers have already done their jobs. All that's left to do is enjoy the fruits of their labor. In other words, Comrade Molotov wants to put Dr. Sechenov in jail over what happened here so he can take over the facility himself? To be exact, he wants to lead Collective. But how can he? Everybody's going to be equal there. Some will be more equal than others. 
No. I know that high-ranking Communist Party members will have more authority and collective than ordinary citizens, but that's fine. I mean, somebody's got to make big decisions, right? Is that so? Why, pray tell? Well, first off, somebody has to be responsible for carrying them out. It's not like everyone can be responsible for everything. Everyone means no one. Someone's got to take responsibility. The buck has to stop somewhere, right? And if the whole world did nothing but debate the decisions, <laughs> no one would ever do anything. They'd spend all their time talking. But what if you're wrong? You say that the entire world would never stop discussing important decisions. Collective is a collective mind. Having merged into one, mankind will instantly know everything anyone wants to express. And in this singular collective, Responsibility will be determined not by fear of punishment, but by awareness. Has anyone ever reached that level, even here in the USSR? We're not perfect, to say nothing of the rest of the world. Absolutely right. The world may not be ready for the launch of Collective. The Soviet Union's leaders understand this. That's why the party will have special discretionary authority within Collective. What's wrong with that? That's how it's always been. Has it really? Or has there always been one indisputable leader? A puppet master controlling the Politburo, the Council of Ministers, and all the rest. Are you trying to say there's going to be one single leader in Collective? I'm trying to say that people will connect to Collective via a neural connector. You mean a thought device. Everyone knows that. The thought device is for ordinary citizens. But individuals in privileged leadership positions will have special engraved connectors that grant them... So this little thing is the reason everything's all jammed up? <laughs> this place is nuts. You can ascend to the surface along with the mirror. For once, you're right. I'd probably reach Nirvana before I could make it back down the way I came. Euh... Alors j'ai rien <rire> entendu de ce qu'ils ont dit les mecs. Euh, de l'autre côté... Non, attendez. <coughs> ok. Ouais, j'ai rien bipé de ce qu'ils ont dit. Have you infiltrated the VDNH yet, Comrade Major? The government's commission's condor has already left Moscow. They'll be here any minute now. If the commission hasn't landed yet, that means there's still time. Just let me work in peace. Shall I report to Dr. Sechenov that it is his requests that prevent you from working? Yeah, you can report on how you ran away from those robots on the maglev platform instead of helping. I am not a soldier, comrade major. I am doing intellectual, not menial labor. Smashing robots is your specialty. The only labor you're doing is talking my ear off. Right now you're wasting my time and slowing ah, down my mission. Ah, je m'en souviens, il me faut un code. What? Nothing. Ah, uh, that's what I thought. How can... Can... I... Allez. How can I... Help you... I need to get into the exhibit. How do I open the door? The line can be... Be... Open with my... Multi-key... Error. Multi-key not found. All Terish Cobra models can transform their index fingers into keys. It's one of their basic functions. Looks like you lost your okay. key. My forearms have been torn off by a miscreant. Error. The required manipulative node is missing. The unlocking function cannot be initiated. Right. Where could she have lost her hands? I suggest you start searching this location. Charles, what do the special neural connectors for Collective look like? You know, the ones the government is supposed to get. The ones they will get look like thought devices, but in a golden <coughs> diamond encrusted shell. The scientists from Dr. Sechenov's team have already received different devices. Different? You mean there's going to be ones with different capabilities? According to Dr. Sechenov's plan, bureaucrats and civil servants will receive fakes. Only the scientists will receive real connectors with discretionary authority. The boss is going to try to deceive the government? That's crazy. How do you know that? Where did you get your neuropolymer glove from, Comrade Major? What? You mean yourself? I got you. So, what will it be, Major? Euh, silence, vous deux. 
Toujours pas. Tant pis. Allez. Ça, il me faut un code. Ah bla bla bla. Charge-toi toi. Bref. Bon par contre il va me falloir plus de capsules de cheveux, il va falloir que je récupère du capsule de soins, c'est parce que là j'en ai plus. J'ai tout utilisé sur le boss. Voilà. Non mais j'ai toujours pas trouvé en fait. And there's Tereshkova's arm. Fuck that. There's no way I'm leaving that thing alive. Voilà. Alors, qu'est-ce qu'on a ici Rien, rien... Ah bah là voilà son bras euh, écoutez là ce que je vais faire c'est que je vais aller sauvegarder Je vais m'arrêter là parce que là, je commence sérieusement à avoir les crocs Donc on se retrouve tout à l'heure